Hi everyone, I am Kelsey Pion. I'm with the Gaffer Group at Simply Vegas, and we are here today at 3241 Montecito Drive in the gated community of Equestrian Estates. These all sit on about a half an acre lot. It is a beautifully reimagined Spanish rival. We've got four beds, five and a half baths, 5,124 square feet of luxurious living space. I'm so excited to show you guys this one. Let's go check it out. Hey guys, love this glass door. First things, nice black framing around it, really unique with the glass. That's so modern and you just don't see that a lot, so it's really cool. And I also have to note these ceilings. I love the beams, they're exposed, they've got a dark color to them, they look really, really cool next to all of this like neutral colored rock. I'm really Loving the just the atmosphere in here. You've got the fireplace, you've got a gas fireplace. It's part of the stairwell, which is really unique. And it's just this nice open room. We've got Provenza flooring. Gives off a nice warm, but like light colored tone. I would say this is like really nice living room. This would be your nice living room area. You've got a nice open space here with a great wall for a TV or whatever you want to use it for. Again, with the high ceilings coming all the way through. And this is a Spanish rival, so that's where you get the dark colors. With you've got a bit of the industrial uh, specs of it with the screws up there. And this is just a really cool sitting area, an office, a den. You've got a really nice vibe in here with, an, a, yet again, another stone fireplace. It's just really awesome in here. I cannot wait to go check out the kitchen. Let's go take a look. Okay, so over here, it flows right into the dining room and the kitchen. First, I just wanna cover this really nice space in here. You've got a really good sized dining room and it's so nice to have it right next to the kitchen. That's something that I know a lot of people desire and for good reason, great for entertaining. Such a nice chandelier up there. Come on over here into the kitchen. Love the navy blue cabinetry and the quartz countertops. It's got a really pretty brown vein through it. Really unique. Loving these brass handles. It's so unique next to the dark blue cabinetry. And of course it's soft close in here because this is a luxury. Um, walk on over here. We've got a really good sized refrigerator. Could hold lots and lots of stuff in here. I mean, this is like commercial sized, I'm pretty sure. Um, you've got, come on over here. We've got the built-in microwave. Very nice. It's a nice drawer microwave, so it fits in really nicely. The first thing I noticed when I came to this kitchen was this white stove. It's so unique. It is electric, which is really cool. You've got the Spanish tile behind here, going with that Spanish rival theme of the house. Really nice pot filler. Have one of these. It's so worth it. I really, really love the, just the, the complete layout of this kitchen. Again, with the gold hardware, everything just looks really, really nice in here. And I love that they continue, the beams continue all the way throughout the house, not just the one part of it. Okay, so we are on the left wing of the house right now, and I just wanna pop in here really quick and admire this laundry room. I love the uniqueness of the Spanish tile in here. I love the colors. This is nice because you can put your washer and dryers under here, but you've got a built-in folding table and some more storage over here. You've got access to the outside, so if you need to take a break from folding laundry and like take a dip in the pool, you can. Over here, we've got a guest bedroom that also has access to the pool. So over here, we've got the only guest ensuite on this side of the house. So everyone's got lots of privacy. If you come in here, you also have access to the backyard, which leads to the side yard. So again, lots of privacy and you're able to just completely access in and out however you'd like. Every single room I feel like has some kind of Spanish tile, which I really like, and they're not all the same. So every bedroom is really unique in every bathroom. The tile in here is really pretty. It's it's kind of a standard subway tile, except for it's got a texture and it's this really cool gray color. So you've got the uniqueness there with the beautiful rain shower head. And in here, you've got a nice built-in. The built-ins in here already done for your guests. So you can in impress them that they've also got a really, really nice closet space in here for when they come to stay. All right, so we're gonna go on the other side of the house, check out the other two bedrooms that are on this level. 
All right, so over here, we've got the first guest bedroom on the right side of the house. I really, really like this light. It's really unique. Um, it's giving it like a kind of bohemian vibe over here. Something else that's my favorite about this room is I love these windows. So we're at the front of the house. You get a ton of natural light. You've got the arched windows here that give it that really cool Spanish architecture. And every single bedroom has a bathroom. So over here, again, the theme, the continuing theme with the Spanish tile. These ones are a little bit smaller. And again, with the textured tile, really, really pretty right when you walk in. This room's a little bit more bright, whereas the other rooms were a little bit of a darker vibe. Um, we've got the white quartz with the white cabinetry. And again, just a really cool, nice private bathroom for any of your guests. Let's go see the other bedroom. All right, we're gonna go check out this really oversized guest bedroom down here. You could honestly kind of consider it a second primary, if you will, because it is really good size. There is only one sink, but a lot of counter space. Love the white next to the dark cabinets. Again, have to mention the beautiful Spanish tile. This one's really unique. It's got a lot of different patterns and design to it. Really nice shower with the rain shower head. Great light coming through here for a bathroom. Check out the bedroom space. Really nice size room. You've got access to the backyard where the pool is. We're gonna go check that out a little bit later. But this is just a really cool room. Really great light, great for guests, great for someone needed to have access to the first floor. So it's perfect. All right, let's go check out the second level. All right, let's go check out the second level, which is the primary suite. All right, here we are in the primary suite, which is the entire second level of the house. So that's really nice. The house really lives as a one story besides this room. Love the natural light coming in here. You've got a good amount of space in here. I think we should check out this closet. Look at this closet. It's such a nice size closet. It's built in already with everything that you need. They did a really nice job with the nice grayish tan color. So it goes for everybody. And I just think there's like plenty of space in this entire closet for everything that you need. All right, I'm excited to show you all this primary bathroom. I love this bathroom. I love the colors in here. I love the layout of it. This is a gigantic shower. Of course, you've got two sides. Everyone has enough space. Nice light coming through the window. I love that they also decided to do a half wall of tile that matches. So everything just kind of flows really nicely in here. Of course, you've got your soaking tub, plenty of space, big enough for everyone, you can relax. Something really unique about this bathroom is there's actually a sauna as well. So I, I can try to come in here. It's a little tight <laughs> if you wanna see it. They decided to make this a sauna. So instead of it just being dead space, like a weird little corner, they put a sauna in here, which is so nice. All right, get out of your sauna, come out here. You actually have a second closet on that side. So his and her closets, beautiful Euro cabinetry. Again, everything's custom in this house. So it's gorgeous. Love the lighting fixtures. And what I really love is the backyard. And we're gonna go check that out next. All right, we're gonna check out this really good sized backyard. This house sits on almost a half an acre, so you've got a really good sized lot. You've got plenty of grass here, beautiful area to just let the kids run around or the dogs. So there's plenty of space. You've got really good sized mature trees out here providing a ton of shade. So that's nice in the summer heat. I love that they put the black rock in here so it kind of continues with the theme of that Spanish rival look that is inside the house. And of course, you've got this beautiful pool, really good size. I love to see a pool this size, plenty of room for everyone to enjoy themselves. Just this entire lot is completely oversized, so it's a really cool space to entertain out here. Okay guys, so this house comes with a really cool bonus area. This is a casita that's just like 10, 12 feet from the pool right here. This is basically a small apartment right in your backyard. So it'd be great, it's, you know, you've got a great ADU back here if you wanted to rent it out. It could be a pool house, it could be the casita, it could be really so many different options, really, really nice. Okay, so the casita also has its own bathroom. So you've got everything that you need in here, you've got the shower over here, you've got the nice size sink and the storage. It's really cool that it just completely matches and flows with everything in here, it matches the cabinetry in here. So honestly, the great stainless steel appliances, it's like everything you'd need for a nice pool house or casita. 
All right, you guys, that is it for Montecito Drive. I hope you enjoyed this tour today. I wanna to thank John Gafford, who is the listing agent on this gorgeous property. His information is below as well as in the description. Please make sure to hit like and subscribe if you like what you saw, and I'll see you next time. It's got the course, everything you need. It's got the sink, it's got the shower, it's got some really, just like, it's just,